Hand me my hat, Finley! I'm going in! Hi, greetings and welcome to Murder at Castle Nathria. And hi, YouTube. I've been gone for a while. For several private reasons. I, I'm still making content and stuff, it's just not really showing up on YouTube. It's, it's Unfortunately, it was a bit out of the question. But maybe we'll see a bit more now. It's just still a bit of a rough time for the next weeks, but there'll be a video now and then. Today, I have for you the most exciting uh, duels run of the first day of Murder Castle Nathria. So, I wish you a good time. And have fun. Bye bye. We'll try this. Seems fun. I'm not sure how we win, but it's probably either Big Edwin, Big Ghosts from the Graveyard, or Necrolord Draka. Or some bull some crazy BS with the Well Kickmaster. We'll see. Let's go. So, Combo Rogue. Booyah. Shivino Palpatino. Thanks for following the stream. Is that a reference to the famous Sheaf Palpatine? Like, prep scam seems pretty good. This looks like a... Um, just burn deck, which probably means we have a, a abysmal chances of winning. But you can play Clockwork Gnome 1 the next turn. Actually, a Clockwork Gnome spare part is gonna be really useful. For combo purposes. Okay, like Ice Bear is not gonna do squat. Um, we're not gonna get to play either of these, so I guess I take the cheaper one. Maybe there's a tiny incy bitsy chance we get to nine. Definitely not to ten. Commander Cabaldo, thanks for following the stream. So nothing much to do right now, so I'll just play this. I get a temporary eviscerate, that's fine. What? Cold case? Okay. Prep. Swindle? Ooh. Serrated bone? Scabs. <sighs> Next two. So if I have. If I shadow step him, play him again. He should cost zero, right? Yes. Uh, hello? Okay. That's pretty good. He's probably gonna have something that stops me from hitting him in the face with that. I imagine if we had our Sinstone Graveyard up there. We'd get another, like, what is that? 7-7 seven, seven or something like that? I think it's just half an Edwin, so 7-7. Seven, seven. Uh. 
Can't even stop the Edwin. Damn it, nothing. Laptops, all of you. What would that even be for one that could do anything? Nothing. Nothing that does damage. Do I even have anything that goes face? Necrolord Draka, I guess. Okay. Okay. Let's see if he can pull this off or not. I mean, he could probably kill me. If he has a 6 damage torch, that's probably lethal. I was kind of sad I didn't find the uh, Draka, I guess. Or the graveyard a bit earlier. Like, this archetype is fun, really fun to play, but if you guess you should run more burn. Let's hope the torch is the last card. It is, so that's no longer lethal. Unless he has prep still, but I think he used prep, yeah. That yeah, still doesn't do anything. I have this. Nice! Nice! We had a kind of bad draw, but so did he, it seems. He was a torch, not showing up and stuff. <laughs> we kind of balanced out. So, sticky fingers, ropes of shrinking. Ropes of shrinking sounds really good in this. If I find more draw, of course. Sticky fingers works well with... One thief, ace in the hole. Well, Kickmaster. Hmm. Of course, Book of Wonders is also not off the table. Hmm. Like, I'm not super fond of either of these, so maybe just take a Book of Wonders and hope we high roll. But it's dumb, like if I hit Book of Wonders with Sinstone Graveyard, uh, not Sinstone, with um, Dwarf Shadows, that's terrible. Like a temporary copy, it's just 5 mana, cast a random spell. I think I just go Robes of Shrinking? No, let's go Sticky, it's more reliable. Volatile, Bog Beast, Mask Reveler, Death Rattle, okay. Tenwu, Plague of Madness, World Kick Master. Plague of Madness sounds kind of terrible, but there are some weapons you really need to destroy sometimes, so it's not as bad as it looks. Workling Master, already in the deck, so really good. Hooked Scimitar, that's fine. I think we'll take this. And let's go. These are not uh, whatever one place. Oh, it's again burn deck. Oh, Draka. Four mana, three four. I could put one three weapon. That's just broken. <laughs> I imagine like a really good Draka. Like if you have a bag of coins, it's kind of nuts. Shatter Shambler, does that do anything? Not really. Maybe we hit something. They could get a runic egg, is more hero powers than just one mana draw a card, which is nice. Oh, okay. Like, these are almost entirely useless against that deck most of the time, so I'll take the mask. For 6 mana, do 10. Good to get it to 4. We will do for future 1 mana death rattles, yep. Especially Runic Egg. 
is the one I think of. It's a 1 3, it's not terrible. Wish I had a coin, it would be a pretty good turn. Uh, is that a deja vu? Didn't the last guy do exactly the same? Also on 3 mana. What? And he did that too! But, uh, I'm not crazy, right? I also played one drop and the one thief, and then he did exactly that play next time. What? I'm not crazy, am I? Oh, Trog, it's really good. What? I'm opening the wrong replay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Is Swamp Dragon Egg in? Are you playing Mine Rogue? Are you kidding me? No, this is Combo Rogue. I just randomly got us off the hero pile. I'd never do that. And you are putting that many question marks there, probably tells me that you know that. I would not do such a thing. It's usually the most overrated hero duels right now. But well, it's just a completely new meta, so who knows? But I really don't like playing against him. I think he needs some significant changes. What did I play last turn? It would be really nice to know. I played Foxy Fraud, Swindle. Mm -hmm. If this if he plays any minion. No, I don't wanna toss away the prep, that's awful. I think I just throw this out as fodder. I have another one in the deck and it's not gonna do that much. I guess it's good for slow matchups, otherwise it's probably useless. Is really the most I already read that. <laughs> most overrated here on duels. I don't think Reno's very good. Especially not at getting at high wins. But he can sometimes do it. And I guess people just, like, we saw in Stormwind that people frequently just enjoy the gameplay where you throw spells around from your hand until you win. Which is the only thing that Reno's good at right now. Eviscerate for that, that paid off. Next turn we go for Draka. We're probably too slow, we're losing this one. Kinda needed a scabs there. Like if I can... Oh, if I draw scabs now I get a massive Draka. I can prep serrated bone spike scabs. Hmm. Serrated bone spike. Um, next card costs two less, so Ace in the hole. Let's get him. We have this. So we currently have lethal, it's just this and the mask. But they have a ton of tricks to stay alive. That's a pretty nice Draka. It's the first Draka I've played ever. Feels pretty good. So we we actually won the game unless he has one mana to do something. Prep. Okay. Looks like he's done for. Nice.
Like, I don't know, I feel like I'm doing what Reno's doing just better. Little Kingsbane. Or the Little Kingsbane. <laughs> mm. Hmm. I think Worship is just all on the best quality card here. Prep Coerce, Shadow Palm Rider, or Shadow Palm. Prep is excellent, Coerce is pretty good. I mean, this is garbage. Shadow Palm is not great. Here, Group Learning, Eviscerate, Mimic. Eviscerate is amazing, Mimic Pod is okay. Onyx Spellstone is trash though. I think I go with combos. Actually, 2 0 with full combo rogue is pretty cool. We're already halfway done. Recu Draka. I don't know, she, she seems like one of the main ways we win the game, so I'd probably keep her. A win condition. Bitter cold. Oh, Shadow Step. I think I'll save it. If this somehow lives, that's actually huge. Mm hmm. Okay. I could do something with the World Kick Master here. Yeah, I think I will. Let's hope the will kick master is safe here. Because then I have some value incoming. Actually lived. <laughs> the Trog is pretty good off that uh, hero power. More one step from Eden music. It's very random. The Arctic. Snap freeze, okay. Still wrong order though. Should ping the Wellkick Master. I played 3, it's summon the 3 3 here. A 4 4. Okay, nice. That's not bad. Wonder how big that Draka can get. Kinda wanna play her after he uses that freeze. Because he could freeze our face. Exactly, all of our opponent. I mean, it didn't matter. I just killed the dude, so. Who cares? Please clearly Kalthus art deck. And I think I want to protect these two so it's okay if that hits this guy. Hit me in the face, that's best. What's this art? He's holding a candlestick. Haunted conscience. We need scabs. The scabs is holding all of this together. 
Okay. Zero mana frees everything. Uh, not a fan. Like, uh, Bitter Cold got so much better since they added that two mana deal three infused frost spell. That one's so good. Ooh, so we can go in quite hard this turn and then we can ace in the whole next. I like that. Draka or Edwin? I think Draka's better. This is literally 15 face damage. Like that, that is glorious. I can just ace in the whole play a bunch of things and Edwin next. Unless it's a counter spell, that's very unlikely. It's probably frost spell. Order again. Let's see what it is. It's Ice Barrier, okay. Let's start off with Ace in the Hole. Let's follow up with uh, Primordial Studies and get this Duot or this Evolve Kobold. Uh, okay. For extra damage. So now I can scabs. Uh, scabs. Tough turns. F four, I guess five. Eviscerate Edwin. No, that was kind of right. It's okay. Pretty thick board, but it's we're gonna get frozen. Imagine just seeing a candle floating around the house in the middle of the night. My cats would go crazy. Yeah. I mean, I think I would go crazy, not just the cats. Do you have freeze? Not quite. <laughs> well, this is so good. I love this deck. Let's see how much stuff we can play this turn. Oh, come on. <laughs> hey, this is awesome. I don't know how good it is, but it's definitely fun. So we don't need mummy magic for anything. Orb of Revelation doesn't reduce much, like our oh, stuff is already super cheap. So Runic Helmet is. I mean we have the sticky fingers for the combo. Oh, this is bad. Pretty good. Sap, Fallon Knives, Jandis, or oh, Secret Passage, Self Sharpening, Steel Dancer. It's, Steel Dancer is kind of nuts. With Draka stuff, right? Sure, let's go. This the secret passage is great. Elise. Definitely Elise. Might be difficult to beat. That's with thick stats. Rocket backpacks, Dra Dragon Elise, a three minutes, mm, that's impressive. Anti-magic shell could actually be nuts. 
I mean, costing three is quite nice. He just summons a one health dude I can and normally price plunder. Oh, one mana death coil. That's pretty nutty. What's thick? Who, who or what here is thick exactly? He forgot he has rush. Uh, frozen touch seems great. Yeah, if I infuse it, like, I keep getting it back, it costs one, that's nuts. Army of the Dead is less useful. Stuff like that will just sit in our hand and not do anything and block some hand space, but that's, it is what it is. So now we just... Uh, Go for the anti-magic shell, protects most of my minions against a Duskbreaker. Oh, that's a portal already. Please don't be scared. Oh my god! He needs to have Duskbreaker though, or he's just toast. I still have seven. That is pretty scary for turn four, and very lucky. Still just need 8 damage to win. Currently I have 7. Um. Seven, twelve. This is this is just BS. They kill this. Ten, fourteen, fire. Let's do this. Oh. Another useless one. Okay. Six damage. This already provides four. Oh, it has rush. Oh, excellent. This board's full, though. I can find five damage. That is four. Okay. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. I don't think he can do 8 from hand unless he's exactly the pure cold. It's exactly pure cold. Hmm. 
Nap tops, all of you, exactly. My music is summoning demons. And this is coming from a metalhead. <laughs> what was the last song? What was the demon summoning song? I didn't pay attention, I was too focused on this. Oh my not deal eight? I think not. La la la. Hmm. Yeah, we're just causing all those salt game overs. It's pretty nice. Let's see what this does. It was not actually that bad, honestly. It was pretty good. Nice. <laughs> Four zero? We were doing better than with the tree and druid. This is very surprising. Hmm, Book of the Dead sounds excellent. Of course, bag of stuffing is good too, but I think Rogue can find enough card draw that I don't really need it. Like this? This is excellent. Sticky situation, Halkias. Private eye, that's nice for a secret deck. Okay, this group learning is actually gloriously good. Let's take it. Questing adventure is medium, but the others are great. Still want to know how we're summoning demons. These are probably pirates. We're fighting Pepper Pig. Well, not technically the pig, but it's still Pepper. I think I should put pull this down a bit. Yeah, like this down here is stuff in hand. You can already see that, so that doesn't really matter. Let's keep the graveyard, and yeah, this this looks okay. Let's see if we can bullshit our way through pirates, because whenever I play a rogue deck like this, it always feels like Mamba's child. It always feels like uh, I'm just BSing, not really playing fair. Who is Mamba? Did I forget a dear viewer of mine? Named Mamba? Elven Archer. I guess. We'll make it work. No, oh, villain's chosen. Okay, nice. That was a whiff. Mook of Wonders is so scary. Mm -hmm. The Idols of a Loon. Okay, I could... Um, coin? Sinstone Graveyard. Price Plunderer. Summon a 3-3. I think I'll hold off on that. And I can get way more out of this. Some dude did that a patch it goes into chats like Zeddy's and gives like 250 subs at a time? Wow! Send him here. <laughs> I can make good use of that. What adventure are you up to today? He's basically a Twitch whale. Very fitting if he does that at Zeddy's place. Mm. Can we get a prep? Let's 
Let's go for the 4 4 here. Waffles a pretty good place to start. That probably didn't do anything. It's very unlikely he has taunts in hand. This deck is awesome. <laughs> you got the triple um, Dunga bucket. More dead mines, okay. Well, it looks like I'm just gonna. Uh, Anti magic shell? We play one thief first. To get. Oh no, that's way better. Prep. One thief. Devolving? Sure. And then we. Get more stuff out there. Oh! What a nice hit. Ram session, I guess. Tome of intellect isn't great. Pretty strong turn. Once again, I, some of these turns are just nuts. Great hit off of the hero power. We have 15 damage. We hit only death coils. Like that is something. Like, there's a 20% I think. Or is it's probably even less than 20% to hit a specific card. Like what is that? There's the Frostmorn, there's Death Coil, there's Death and Decay, there is the board AoE thing for five. It could have healed no wait, this is it's slowed down. Damn it. There's the Army of the Dead. Is there anything else? There's the Obliterate, there's a Steal from Dexter, there are like seven. Let's Shadow Step that. Flame Ward. A 5 5 stealth. We're just lethal with all of these death calls. Devouring Swarm! If that was an Edwin, that would have been funny. Like, we would have all died. Except for the Starfish. Hello, going for some aggro rogue. Hi, Chalker. No, it's not aggro, it's a uh, full combo. Start to finish. And it's doing super well, as you can see, at 4 0 right now. It's really fun. Like, it's doing way better than I expected. Probably thanks to the um, runic helm, though, that's a pretty good treasure. So we have lethal because we somehow on rolled three death coils in a row. Also Book of the Dead. Yeah, so just kill him from hand, I guess. <laughs> nice. I'm really having fun with this. Oh, excellent. <laughs> Just what we want. We don't have enough weapons for this prep. Uh, hmm. Okay, prep is excellent. Sap is really good. Cloak of Shadows. Maybe, yeah, that, I mean, that's kind of like a pseudo ice block. Maybe it's sometimes. Sometimes having that is excellent. Okay, five. Let's go. Five zero. Go for a hat loot drop. Oh damn, I didn't sa actually set that up. Okay, let's go to an RNG. I know number generators. Look for the number between 1 and 100. And generate. 55. 
Let's look at the loot table. And what do we get? 55, like, I think that is just a rare. Let me see what, what I wrote there. Oh, wait, no, you're exactly in the common one. Whoops. If you had 56, it would have been rare. So, what's a common hat? Well, something that's not actually here. Great. I'll get that in a moment. <laughs> Woefully unprepared, because no one has used this stuff in a while. Uh, let's, let's go for this. One, one sec, be right back with a common hat. There. You unlocked a Blues Brothers mode. Good job. I still need to find better headphones for this. I'll probably need some ear thingies. Take a screenshot by accident, oops. We have two preps in hand, that is so cool for Draka. But the systems are there to work, so testing them. Wait, what? Okay, fixed it. The quest line, I see, I see. Snack! I'm gonna overdraw one. That's okay. It's probably not important. So, next turn we can go for a gigantic Draka? Wow. That's going to be so huge. Okay. Prep. Inside. Zero. Coin. Go face with that. Prep. I should have played that after this. No, wait. Ah. I should have shadow stepped that. No, I can't. I misplayed there. And then I return him. <laughs> that was pretty good, but I, I, I screwed up. This could be like a 10 or 11 attack dagger and I could have more stuff, I think. That was pretty good! I think I keep this for bigger Draco. That's not fair. Kill that off, I guess. Mm hmm. Okay, um, let's go. Snap freeze. Just five this time, but that's fine. How much more healing can this guy have? Eh? Yo, Nilon, welcome to the stream. You just played, and Innocuous George just played some Dude Pal, and I hope it becomes meta. It was fun. 
Nice, uh, did you use Quest Town or not? Because I suspect that it might be better without it. Come on! I already copied that with Quark, well. Sure, clear your own board, I'm all for it. Death grip's nice for some extra value. Should also all be reduced, right? Oh no, you just use all the silver hand stuff minus Warhorse Train or whatever. Yeah, I think it's a better idea. The Stormwind Quest is terrible. Then Athreus? Nice. Go away, thanks. Mm. Let's see what we get here. Loot hoarder. Why does this not cost one? Yeah, I think I should... That's a small bug that I should report. But hey, we got this now. Should maybe play this, but I'm too excited too for this combo. Next turn, Frost one lethal. Let's go. We got some good buckets, so I'll have to tune it with Firestone later. Yeah? Like then, Afrius causes at least causes big friends. I saw that uh, in the previous week. Well, uh, well, the Nathria buckets. Not your cards were already in bucket. Oh, he gets a taunt. That doesn't do anything. Oh, okay. 6-0 with a complete experimentation deck. Love it. King's Bane, Tooth of Nefarian, Krastinov. Hmm. Terrible. These are pretty good, actually. Like, not amazing, but way better than this other stuff. Just as usual, we'll be essing our way to victory. You stand no chance. Stands against the crook. Yeah, I mean, that should be given. <laughs> I genuinely love almost. No, not almost. I genuinely, genuinely love every single song in the playlist. <laughs> I think I keep scabs. Little than reinforcements. Congratulations on your achievement. <laughs> She's probably sitting there like, why is he saying this stuff? I don't know. I, I genuinely don't know why I'm saying this stuff. We gotta get them to make it duels friendly over the next expansion. The bottom left is a bummer. Yeah. Okay, so let's get... This, the next turn we can start building a scary questing. Ugh, this is all worthless. Glacial downpour. So maybe vaporize will come in handy. Yeah, I already told Alkali last time, so I don't know if she missed it, or if they are aware or not, like, I have no no clue. So is this a skeleton Reno? Let's prep the swindle. 
and coin. I guess we kill this to maybe protect this guy. If he can't kill this, he's in big trouble. I wouldn't put questing in the deck, it's a bit outdated of a card, but it's it's the right type of card for this deck. Who's that as play? Oh! Oh boy. I have bad news for you. So let's uh, prep, I guess. Wrap. Vaporize. Scabs. I think I just play this vanilla. Secret passage, wow. Now it's gonna get frozen, but it's okay, we got in a very big hit. My scabs! Another one. I should have attacked with these face first, this could have killed him. Too many frost ones. Door shows, what does he get? Let's hope it's not a small freeze card. Solid alibi. That's annoying. Very annoying. Okay, just that we got reduced. So what do I get? Uh, can I draw? I think I start with Frostmorn actually. He's he has a solid alibi up. And yeah, I think he has one more. I'm not sure. It didn't say created by, right? So he might not have another one. This is the third one. No, the second one. No, yeah, but it's too many. It's not, not acceptable. So let's play this. Play it again, I think. Okay. Oh, okay. Pretty good. I enjoyed this turn. Now if he's out of freeze, these are gonna just crunch. Another solid alibi. Yeah, this card's not gonna get annoying at all. Not at all annoying. I'm just... You're probably never gonna be able to hit him correctly. Wow, that was very lucky. He's just gonna keep putting up alibis and evasions and Cloak of Shadows. And then he's gonna play uh, Dawn Grasp and repeat, repeat all of them. Hmm. Let's steal something. Skeleton.
At least I also get healing with this. Yeah, duels friendly overlay. I kind of like these candles in the corner, you know. Another overlay, there's a giant cake that uh, covers it even harder. Stop freezing my adventure. They either they are frozen or he has a solid alibi. It's just happening every turn. What did you play last? Nothing I really want. Uh -huh. Let's go with Secret Passage here. It's a bit late, but the rest of the hand is kind of shit right now. Oh, an Edwin. Okay. How much longer can you freeze everything? I'm not pressing this button because I might overdraw if I do. I'm, I'm still overdrawing. I wouldn't have gotten this back. I vaporized though, so if he goes face with that, it just dies, which would be very nice. This would look more ripe for trading, but he might also need to hit a big dude to make him, you know, not be able to attack. Ah, he played around vaporize. Boom. It's all going face. Puzzle box. Seal of light. Oh no. Overflow. Well. Draw like 30 more cards, please. What a great puzzle box so far. Contraband stash. Doesn't do anything. Bioluminescence! Why are you kidding me? Okay, it didn't do that much. Please be out of stuff, thanks. You have currently a Maligos for free. This is just BS. Oh boy. Play. Uh, what did you play last? Frozen Touch. Okay. First of all, let's do this. These spell damage doggos have to go. No. Frozen touch. Frozen touch. Press this. Heal myself. Maybe I should have used that. Draw two cards. Cloak of Shadow seems like it could have been useful. Press play this. Throw away one of those. Okay. Okay, kill that. Okay, let's kill the dog, just be safe. If this ever gets to attack, he instantly dies. There's still a Kalthazard incoming, but all those skeletons might just give it, get wasted on this adventure.
I can... I need to draw my... Thingy. How many of those does he have? Necrolord Draka. Next turn, maybe. Out of freezes, maybe? And no burn to kill me, thanks. Could have played this to draw another card. I'm already kind of low of cards in my de on cards in my deck. Hmm. Come on, this 42 attack. That's the answer to the qu question. Oh, he's gonna overdraw me. Do you have anything in the deck that kills a sap? Sinstone graveyard. Okay. Coerce as well. So is he gonna get eaten by a gigantic questing? <laughs> no! Come on! I've built this entire game! At least let me eat you! Just build... No honor among thieves. That's so sad. Well, whatever. Uh, another Hunter's Insight, that seems great. Tenwu, that seems good. Shaku. Mm -hmm. I mean, Shaku and Henchclan Burglar are really good with Sticky. Maybe I go with this then. Because I'm not too fond of the Feldery Strider, it doesn't really do anything when a deck gets really big. You know, you don't find those. It's just a 4 mana 4 4. My level and strike is not gonna get reduced much unless I play this. So it's also a really bad card. Ten was great, but the other two suck. And these are just not good cards overall. Cold Blood's eh. Decent. But Perdition's Blade is awful. A Steel Dancer is sometimes good, but I don't have that many weapons anymore. So I think I'll go with Light Fingers because the cards I get are cost reduced and it could be really good. So let's go. I need to leave the headphones. Because it's getting hot in here, so hot, I'm opening the balcony door. This is good, questing was really good last time, but I don't know, I don't think I have the hand for it right now. So what is this? Is this balls or is it neutral? So it's either balls or big vanda? We'll see. Inspiring presence, it looks like big. Second looks like balls, so I have no idea what's going on here. But like, we can get some really good things against big stuff. This is also great against big stuff. Just sits in the way. Huh. Okay, I have the value. I think I just drop the Sinstone here and pass. Actually, it's 7 0. I just made for big brain decks. Gonna drop these and hold this for a better turn. It's just gonna get better longer. Wait, I don't need it right now. If I leave this up, I can play Price, price Plunderer. Shell. I could even price plunder a graveyard shell for 4-4. Four, four. We'll see. If I, if I top deck a prep, I have 3 in the deck. Or oh, shadow step, like, then I can go in, like, pretty hard. 
He's neutral, he's got mage spells though. But it's, there are not that many cheap mage spells that deal with a white board well. That starts at like 6 mana. Except for fire sale. Anti-magic shell just got a lot worse. Oh, Shaku though. Let's drop some dudes here. Make a 3-3, three, three. I'll make a 3-3 three, three, because next turn I might want to play the anti-magic shell. Like every turn, but it's okay. 3-3 three, three stealth, let's go. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to AoE at this mana. He wants to play, start playing his minions now. Oh. And this one, so we are up against a Spellbender, it looks like. Get this one drop out there. It's a ball. I'm gonna lose. I like overdraw. Oh no! I get coins? Because he's neutral. That's actually pretty good. But there's nothing I can use it with right now, so I'll coin and throw this at him to get some hand space. I mean, I could use it next turn. But I'd rather draw a good card right now. My hand is not that great at the moment. I got a new coin anyway, as long as this guy lives. Which is very likely, like it's super difficult to kill. Yeah, like... Yeah. Might just... yeah. Let's go for this. Well, I'll overdraw this time, which is... um... yeah, I just didn't think about it, honestly. <laughs> 10 mana, 10, 10 taunt. This is a focus card. <laughs> he seems to have a pretty jank deck. How did he get to 7 0? Oops. <laughs> oh boy. Don't eat this. Yeah, okay, whatever. He didn't even put up a fight. This was just free. What? <laughs> Bad. Okay, but it's normal, please. Nice. With the unhealthiest drink I could find. Oh no, are we up against boars now? Uh, and if they go this far, they're probably nuts. Might be something else though, who ne you ne Oops, you never know. Maybe I should have kept the bone spike. Ooh. Rocket cat gas. Huh. Like rocket sounds like balls. But a second is a miss. It might also be rush with a second miss, which would be very sad for him. Oh it's Hunter? Uh yeah. Duh. What is this? Rush.
You need to draw a relevant card and stop getting frost mons as well. And six mana frost mons pretty playable at seven. It's a bit rough. This is just wild seeds. That's awesome. Three frost ones in a row. Why? Why? <laughs> Come on. Hats off for Frostmore. If you just repeatedly get the same thing, it should, it should all be cheaper. Uh, I'll just drop this. It's so terrible. This hand, come on. Come on, baby. It's zero. We're basically doing nothing. Let's try this. Because me losing the hats, that is a travesty. You paid for that. You got how this is look. Okay, actually. Yeah. I will not press the button, I'll overdraw. Hmm. Really hope I draw something that does stuff. <laughs> Opponent might be thinking the same thing though. He got the wild seeds though. Yeah, like how many wild seed cards are there? Guess we start using that. There's so many of them. Yeah, I need the death coils for some healing. Did you just get a ton of wild seed buckets and it's still boar? What's going on? Oh, my prep, my glorious prep. Okay, barricade, I guess. <laughs> triple frost moon, triple anti magic shell. I mean, in poker, that would be pretty good, right? <laughs> it's better than a full house. Now, oh, after I attack, I get two to three dudes. Why are you still playing that at 5 mana, by the way? It's not even that good anymore. Ooh. 
Interesting, I'll take that myself. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately, they are dormant. I did not think this through that well. So I die right now. I thought I had a pawn somehow. Oh, God. Taunt? It does nothing. Okay, this this draw was just a disaster, and the uh, summons, no, the summons, the, 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 the generations off of the Runicum were also pretty much useless. I like the exerciser here. Nothing. Yeah, that was just a pretty sad round, honestly. <laughs> we ate zero, and then we have to hit something like this. Feels pretty nice, unless you're. Uh, your draw's awful. Are you trying to ruin my espionage? This is pretty good together. Ooh, Darius. Maybe pirates? Maybe rush. Pirates. Oh, we meek master, that's pretty scary. I eh, just need a bunch of death and decays and we're gonna be fine. <laughs> Not like three force wounds and three anti magic shells like last time. No coin? Nice. And you got a prep and an Edwin. So we can get a pretty sick turn. Next. Oh, we just got even better, thanks so much. So we're gonna build a massive Edwin. What are we, what way are we gonna do? What do you prep out? This is still gonna cost one after, so it doesn't matter. This. Play this. Play this. Now I can spend one more mana. That's a fourteen fourteen. Not bad. Could kill that with a Rusty. Which would just cost four because it's meat mastery. Currently this death and decay looks very delicious. Yes. We start with this. Mm, wind fury. <laughs> okay. Let's go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's brutal. <laughs> ah, good cards, but nothing's better than good cards. Because we want to read, uh, hit our extremely good cards more consistently. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. We're up against Mage. And Lego Madness is kind of nice. Uh, Weapon counters, if they have treasure weapons, but I'm probably not keeping it. So, this is probably Mech Mage, right? With Strekthar. Uh, yeah, Band of Bees. Hmm. Okay, there's scarier stuff out there, but it's very scary with the Mecha Shark. 
Oh, it's two or less now, but they can reduce the cost quite easily. Rana. Oh, nice, we have a board clear now. Does it do anything disgusting? This cruise tank? I think I just start use this and start uh, beating that up. So we can send that in next. That's getting obliterated. He's probably putting that on there. Converting stored no, here? Okay. Now, how do I kill this then? Uh, probably still killing this, right? Yeah. He can just grow so much with this uh, optimized polarity stuff and murderize me, so I'm gonna kill it while I can. And these are nice, but they take a lot of health. One mana destroy, guys. Hell of a tempo play. just bump this mm. yeah I could prep scabs doom packed Edwin but then he just has a poisonous Russia and it dies so it's not great Let me save this for Draka then. So we're gonna prep that. Didn't need that, didn't need that, didn't need that, didn't need that. Okay, nice. So I'll just press this button, rush that in, and hold. There's not really a reason to attack right now. Okay, now I have a reason to su maybe sometimes attack. War commands, let's go. Put something on there. No? Yeah, nice. Okay, so they're never rolling rush next turn, right? They can rush one at most, right? They're never gonna kill both of those. Right? Just needs a mecha shark and they both die instantly, unfortunately. That's probably the wrong one to kill. Oh.
Are you good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How's duels? So far, super awesome. But um, duels is also like uh, very, very difficult to judge, and it can take forever until they actually know what's going on. Yeah, so this will just clear everything. Oh no, wait, it costs three, not two. Haha! <laughs> but this uh, kills whatever it wants. So you should have, yeah, done that. Please live. It lived. Excellent. So let's do this. Boom! It's looking good. Could have got since it's poison, I guess and any moment everything could just die. Do something like uh, explosive sheep or whatnot. Uh-huh. Uh I'm just going for face now. Okay. So I have six eleven. Say 1924. This is cold blood, right? I can't target anything here. Mm, no, no. Can you just kill me from hand somehow? That would be not Poggers. Let me eviscerate. No! How much life? Three. Give me an eviscerate. Can you deal 15? It's so unlikely. Well, like having him at 1, it's so scary. There's always the Mecha Shark Reflections combo. Oh wait, you were frozen. Exactly. I was frozen. Yeah. Oh, if he had now he cheats a ton of mana, I could actually die. Nice! Scammed a mech mage. 10 <laughs> 1? I mean, say what you will, but if you get to 10 wins with the deck, then it's probably is something to it. Okay, I'm um, probably healed. Yeah. Healed is usually better than the top head, in my experience. No more, please. Ten, just closing in on the actual 12 wins, which would be nuts with a deck like this. Just, and it is not a tempo deck either. Like, that's awesome. This is, those are kind of my favorite decks. I do like tempo decks a lot. Let's keep scabs. Scabs is insane. So we're up against a uh, mage with harness the elements. This is probably for easy. Arctic armor, glacial downpour. Well, uh, that's exactly. I didn't get Army of the Dead for a very long time. Oh! That might prove to be a mistake. Is he gonna frostbolt me or something? Oh, right, okay. So, what are we gonna do? Spin 
like the sun, strike like the wind. Let's see if that can live. If it can, it's a ton of value. And 4 half is kinda difficult to deal with. Yeah. Guess what, bitch, uh, baby? Oh no, I shouldn't have said that. It lived. Uh, sorry. Let's start with this. Make it poisonous as well. Save this for when I can attack. This is either Oasis Ally or Ice Barrier. Or Ice Block, but Ice Block is extremely rare. Icicle Cypher Mana. Okay. Our dude's dead. Ripozo. Uh, oh. Button. Let's just. I'll hold this. It's too valuable just to throw it away to get this guy plus one plus one. We use a lot of stuff to kill my one four. So we might not be able to kill a four four now. I might be able to freeze it. Cold case. Okay. First. Oh. Mm-hmm. Cold wraith. Spring water sounds very good in this spot. Like we just like this runic helm is so good. Quill the law. Get me my plague of madness. Like this moment, this instance. They always have quelled a lot of this high wind amount. Of course not. Give me something from your deck. Okay, Kalthazard. Easy. Thanks. Who encounters flow? So five mana draw a card, draw another card. Hold on, I have a child issue. Was ist los? Was ist los? Okay, okay, I'm back, baby. Quill the law, huh? Don't really want to take six, but I can heal myself. Okay, let's check the secret explosive. No, uh, oh, I got a death card, exactly what I need. Do not die to quell the love. It's always quell the love. 
I don't like that treasure anymore. It just makes turns high rollers into even higher rollers. Uh. Like this is not a good play, unless they have exact and uh, because they still have this. I'm not gonna hit anything good. Okay. One. Two. Three. Three. Let's save that for later. Any burn just kills me, but this is the best I can do. This is Quellilla being BS. Would be okay, like if the second part, if the AOE just hit minions and not the face, I think this would be far more acceptable. And just, yeah, like what am I supposed to do? Worthless. Yeah. Just not never being able to have a board and taking 16 to the face from one car, that's a bit much. So if the, just the 16 to the face part was gone. Double cross. Yeah, those don't do enough. Uh, am I gonna lose the 12 again because I get hit hit by multiple Quellalars? Okay. Oh. Probably keep the worshipper. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe keep this actually. Maybe that is something I need to destroy. Backpacks, bones, okay. I didn't see my Draka much in recent games. So are they Bomb Warlock? Probably. Am I just playing them? Oh, okay. Oh, they just die instantly. Oh, that's still in the game. Cool. Someone said Journal Chick is 14 times. Since it's just 4 damage times 14, that's just 40. That's just 52 damage, so uh, I'll clearly just survive this turn 2 OTK. Because I have a 2 health minion. I... So, super awesome dual run ends like this. Complete garbage. Brittle Bones needs to change because this is a thing. And it's super dumb. So, can we give him some healing? I just took 36 damage because I dared play a minion. Okay, so I guess I can. But they'll just kill off the stuff. And I didn't even get healing, so it doesn't matter. Or just any spell that kills these. Just a non game, and this is. Ugh. This needs a hotfix, I completely agree. It's like flame waves, but we better. What does this have to do with flame waves? I took 36 damage. You don't play 18 fire spells turn 1 or 2 or something. Well, that took a while to figure out. Real genius over there. Uh, 
can't ever play minions. Yeah, but Flame Wave doesn't even care if didn't even care if you played minions or not. It's a bit different. But, well, so much work for ten. Well, I guess ten is good, right? Like, I want the twelves though. Oh, nice rewards. All right, let's open up the two packs we got and go for another one. Probably the last one, then it's already past midnight here. But I'm pretty hooked on caffeine right now, just for this purpose. Demolition Renovator, nice tech card. So, yeah, there's at least one more run in me. Like, I complained a lot last run, but it was pretty great. Like, there's just a few smaller issues here and there. But overall, like, Duels feels nice. It's just Brittle Bones that's BS. And Quell the Law, I, I'm starting to like it less and less. But it's a thing.